Hello everybody, this is Imran Aziz. I am a PhD student at Uppsala University, Sweden. And in this video, I will show you how to measure the axial ratio of a circular polarized antenna. So uh, this is the anechoic chamber which we have at Uppsala University. And you can see this. Uh, uh, so this is the horn antenna which I am pointing at right now. So this is mounted at uh, at a tower, and then uh, I have uh, the signal generator. Uh, signal generator is placed over here. So right now I am uh, using this horn antenna as a transmitter, and the antenna under test is is over there on the on the other side, uh, which is on a on a gimbal which can rotate 360 degrees both in the elevation plane and uh, in the horizontal plane and uh, so the way to to measure the axial ratio is that uh, uh, for example at we uh, if we want to measure at the specific angle at the bore site right now the antenna under test is looking towards the bore site and uh, we can rotate the the horn antenna around its axis so i will show you in a while how how we do that so we will rotate this antenna and uh, this this standard antenna and during this rotation we will stop in between and measure the value of what signal we are receiving so here at the transmitter side uh, so standard antenna is being used as a transmitter right now so we have the signal generator and uh, we have the the horn antenna uh, so these are the measurements at 28 gigahertz and over here <coughs> if i show you more more closely so it's a little bit mess around here but uh, yeah so here so this is the gimbal which i'm talking about and uh, so this is the antenna under test uh, this is the module which is used to provide the, the baseband signal and then, then it modulates it to the 28 gigahertz and uh, we can rotate this gimbal both both in this plane and also in, in this plane. Um, yeah, and then we have connected this, this gimbal to the, uh, to the spectrum analyzer over here. So the baseband signal is being received over here and we can measure the signal uh, when we run the the measurement and then this is the the motion controller which controls the motion of the of the tower of the horn antenna so this will control the motion so i will show you in a while uh, uh, so i have the matlab code for that uh, so this matlab is uh, Controlling are the equipments, this uh, motion controller, spectrum analyzer, uh, this gimbal, antenna under test, and the the signal generator on the on the other side. So all of these components are be con being controlled by the MATLAB. So I will run this. Uh, uh, I will run the code and show you how the measurements are performed. Okay, now I have. Uh, I have started the started the script. So the the antenna under test. So the calibration is being being done on the antenna under test, and uh, in a while you will see the the tower on the other side. So it will rotate around its axis, and. Uh, yeah, so you see it started moving. It moves around three degrees and then it stops. And when it stops, uh, in the meanwhile, I measure the power uh, on the spectrum analyzer. So now it measures all these, these polarizations. And one thing we need to take care of is the the cable on the other side. This cable which goes from horn antenna to the signal generator. 
because if we rotate too much like more than maybe 360 degrees so this cable may break so right now I am rotating only 180 degrees because after 180 degrees the orientation will be similar so you see here here you can see this uh, on the on the motion controller so it it jumps a few degrees and then it stops and uh, here you see on the spectrum analyzer the the power being received and here you can see the different power levels i am receiving so you can see the power level minus 3.83 minus 4 so if same power is received for all different angles it means the antenna is very good circular polarized and if the difference is is only three degrees it means that uh, it's a good circular polarized antenna so now it is finished so now you can see that i am again at at the same uh, same position of the horn antenna so i moved 180 degrees and i have recorded all, all the measurements in my in my matlab code so and so right now this measurement was for the for the bore site because the antenna under test it is it is looking at at the bore site uh, so if if i want to measure in the at the other angles i just rotate this gimbal to different angles like in the horizontal plane i rotate this to different angles and i do the same measurement again and if i want to measure in the elevation plane I move to different elevation angles and do the measurement again uh, so this will give me the axial ratio at all these different angles uh, so yeah so this is what uh, I wanted to show in this video okay thank you very much bye bye